the district unit of Mahila Congress is taking out a protest march towards the Raj Bhavan here in Tiruvananthapuram. Here we can see that the, these uh, Mahila Congress workers are raising slogans. Uh, they are in support of Rahul Gandhi, in solidarity with Rahul Gandhi, and they are also spe uh, talking about the police action on protesting Congress leaders and MPs uh, last night in Delhi. Uh, Jabi Mehtar MP, who was dragged uh, and uh, take, uh, uh, taken uh, uh, into uh, custody by the police last night while uh, protesting, is the state president of the Mahila Congress. Here we can see that uh, the, they have brought an effigy of Prime Minister Narendra Modi and they had actually uh, burned that effigy. On the other side, we can see that there is heavy police barricading. Uh, there are a lot of uh, women uh, uh, police of, uh, officials that are here at the spot uh, to uh, to ensure that things uh, doesn't uh, go out of hand. It was in the same stretch uh, last week when Congress, uh, youth Congress workers and KSU workers have protested, which led to a heavy lathi charge uh, last week. The protesting Mahila Congress workers here are, uh, pro uh, sup uh, pro are raising this in support of uh, Rahul Gandhi and also against the police action on MPs uh, in Delhi. entire world agrees that we do need to end this conflict but are we in store for virtually an endless war because neither side would want to give up any territorial claims. Where is our diaspora and how are such radicals able to raise funds in western nations when it is a fact that such funds are used for anti-India operations? Under Prime Minister Narendra Modi, Parliament has broken okay, all records of productivity. Yeah. But this time around, we see there is a standoff. Jepsi Baraj just says it's just a defense. He should stand up and say that I put, okay, I, I apologize, I made a mistake. Yes, removing security outside the High Commission is fair enough, but uh, it's not like the protests have stopped, and it's not like the British authorities are, you know, are trying to stop these protests.